Let's make some chili. Oh, I have a giant pot of cooked beans. I'm going to cook them more because I think they're still, no, no, still up from here. So while my beans are still cooking, I'm going to prep the other things that are going in this. Onion. Oh, my eyes. I'm going to put a little bit of water in my big blue pot. That'll help cook the onions and stuff. Throw the onions in the big blue pot. Let's chop up a buttload of garlic. One trick I have with garlic is I'll just like take the clove that's all wrapped up and I'll just crush it in my finger. And that usually makes it easier to, um, to peel. It pops out fairly easily that way. Pop! That's this garlic! Pop this. Let's spice it up. So I have all these frozen hot peppers that I got over the summer and I don't actually know how spicy any of them are. Uh, this will be a surprise. I'm gonna kind of sloppily chop each one and throw it in. Uh, throw those in the pot. Boom. Got these uh, crushed reds. Oregano. Not spicy, but a good spice. Uh, when you buy chili powder, it's mostly cumin, so plenty of cumin. You can, I just use like a third of this. Plenty of paprika, smoked paprika, it's very tasty. I just like have too many fenugreek seeds, so I'm putting some fenugreek in here. At this point, your chili should smell like chili. Yeah, get the onion all sauteed, that garlic should be cooking up nicely. I always like have a little uh, beef replacer. I'm gonna use this brick of tempeh. Chop it up! Add water to make sure this doesn't burn. I'm just chopping this into crumbs. Throw that tempeh into the pot. All right, so everything's all sauteed. It is time to add the tomatoes. I'm just using cans of tomatoes because that's easy. Um, cans of diced tomatoes, so you get like the chunks. Let's throw some peanut butter into this chili. See what happens. I'm using like a quarter cup, half cup. I really love peanut butter. You love it, my friend, you marry it. Don't forget to throw in a bay leaf. I forgot the salt. So the beans are cooked enough, so we can throw them into the pot. Drain the beans. I got three beans here. I got pintos, I got black beans, and I got kidney beans. It's gonna be three bean chili. Ow, it's hot. Protect yourself. Ugh. Sometimes cooking can be draining. If you've never used this before, it's called liquid smoke, and it basically is just like a liquid you add, and it makes things taste kind of smoky, as the name implies. There's that bay leaf. Don't eat the bay leaf. It'll kill you. Now you leave it on low heat and just let it sit for like a day. I'm actually gonna let it sit for like a couple hours then I'll put it in the fridge for like a day. So my chili sat overnight and now we gotta try it. It's definitely got like a peanut butter to it. Just like a look. It's not spicy enough. A little more smoky spicy with the chipotle pepper. Stir it up. Stir it up. Maybe put it in some Tupperware containers. Eat it with your favorite food. Enjoy! Enjoy!